The FOF Passport 3.0 has a super easy way to put the bobbin in. And if you forget, there's a little picture on the door. So the key is that you always put the bobbin in so the thread is coming off the left side of the bobbin. So when you drop it in, it'll look like it's spinning counterclockwise. Then follow the groove with the white arrow and just keep going. Now, I do like to sometimes put my finger on the bobbin so it stops spinning, puts a little resistance because, because from here to there, there's a slight little click underneath here and that's putting the thread in the bobbin tension area. But you just have to follow the path. When you get your thread all the way down to the bottom, there's a little arrow it kind of points to you and that's because there's a little cutter. So you can cut the thread there or you can put the door on and then cut the thread. But the nice thing is, is you don't have to bring the bobbin thread up to start to sew. Just put your fabric underneath, lower the presser foot and start stitching. When you use the thread snips to cut the thread, you'll also notice that your threads are pulled to the back side cut off and once again the bobbin thread is hidden. You'll only have the small length of thread underneath the presser foot that you just need to keep under the foot and start to sew when you're ready. That's how easy it is to work with the bobbin on the FOF Passport 3.0.